Hello everybody, Soda Hunter here. I'm in uh, Detroit, Michigan right now, and uh, I'm done for the day. It's uh, just just winding down. Right now as I'm doing this video, it's about uh, 6.15 local time. Barely able to find a spot in this truck stop. People uh, people like to stop early <laughs> sometimes when they're trucking. They, they, like to, uh, they like to fill up the parking spots before anybody else can get in there. And I was lucky, I found one spot. But um, I wanna show you something really weird. Um, that. <laughs> it's uh, very, very strange. Uh, it drew my attention to it when I saw it. It's uh, a watermelon soda made by Kawi. I, I think I'm saying that right, Kawi. And uh, it's canned in Miami. And um, it's strange. That's weird. I'm sorry. I don't know what nationality that little boy's supposed to be. Um, I think it is a Cuban soda, but I really don't know if that little boy is supposed to be Cuban or not. He is uh, tearing up a watermelon. <laughs> oh, it's almost uncomfortable to look at. <laughs> well, <laughs> anyway, um, I have no clue what this is. What this is, um, like I said, I think it's Cuban. I uh, went into a world market one day and I saw about uh, five different Cuban sodas. I think they're Cuban. I know one, one or two for a fact are Cuban. And I assume since they're all bottled by the same, can by the same company, that they're all going to be Cuban. So, uh, the little buck tooth child, I can't. <laughs> He's so happy eating that watermelon. It's insane. Um, I hope this tastes as good as he makes it look. It's supposed to be watermelon soda and uh, sweetened with sugar and corn syrup. So, like it says right there, Naturally, natural and artificial flavors. So it was only a dollar. It, it it's like a big brand commercial with all these chemicals in it, all sorts of chemicals. I don't know why they do that, but let's see. I have no clue what to expect. I don't know what it's going to look like. I, it kind of looks pink, and it is pink. Pink watermelon soda. So that's a good start. At least it's not clear or. Uh, green or something weird like that. At least it is pink, like it's supposed to be. Wow. Okay, hang on a minute. It's got that watermelon smell to it. That is so strange. Um, I've never had a watermelon soda. I've, I've, I've seen like watermelon flavored or melon flavored things. It doesn't necessarily distinguish one melon from another. It could be honeydew, cantaloupe, uh, watermelon, whatever. It's not a natural watermelon smell. It is more like uh, if you got like watermelon bubblicious or something. That's the smell it, it has. So I, I guess I'm assuming that it's going to end up tasting like candy watermelon. It smells good though. I've never had this. Never had anything like this. So I don't know what to expect. So let's go. Oh, that's good. Wow. Wow, that's good. Oh, I could drink those all day. Wow. Um, he ain't joking. He's happy about that watermelon. <laughs> it's, uh, that's a good soda. I'm completely shocked that that's actually really good um it's really sweet but at the same time it's not real syrupy you know it's not overly sweet um you might get a little bit of natural watermelon flavor in there but for the for the most part it's candy watermelon but that's not a bad flavor i mean i like watermelon flavored gums and stuff like that it's got a good carbonation level not too much. I mean, you saw the way it attached to the bottom of the... Well, you can't see now because it's already done it, but... It attached to the bottom of the glass uh, about like a 7-Up or something like that would. Um, it didn't fizz up crazy, but it didn't have to. It's uh, good. It's really good. Worth the dollar, definitely. So if you guys go to World Market and you see uh, a whole end cap of, of Cuban sodas... I've tried two so far, 
and um, the other video is, is another can, um, Yerba Mate, Yerba Mate Soda. Um, go check that one out if you uh, haven't already. It's uh, kind of a tea soda, and I like that one a lot. I like this one a lot. This one's really good. So, don't be put off by the creepy, uh, maybe racist kid on the front of the can um, chowing down on watermelon. Don't be put off by that. He likes the soda because it's, it's good. So, I highly recommend that. If you see that anywhere, green can, the only watermelon, straight watermelon soda I know that I can get my hands on without paying for some shipping from Japan or something. Um, if you see that, go for it. You're not going to be disappointed. You just you got to like watermelon. Or watermelon bubblegum, anyway. That's that's how to describe it. It's watermelon bubblegum, right there. That's really good. Really good. And um, I like it. Go out and get one. Uh, I know they're at World Market. Um, and if you like this video, follow me on Twitter at Soda underscore Hunter. Facebook.com slash Soda Hunter Kevin. Subscribe to the channel, like the video. Have you ever had a watermelon soda? Have you ever had one of these Cuban sodas? I've never seen them until just recently. Let me know, talk about it. Um, any melon flavored anything I'm interested in. So if you see something, if you know something, let me know. And um, until next time, thank you for watching.